Hey, I'm Jay Cruz. So you're going on a trip. Let me help you figure out what to put all your stuff in. Welcome to another Jet with Jay. This time, let's talk about what to pack and how to pack it. These are all bags that I have traveled with. And I want to start right here with the big boy. I have checked this, I have carried it on, and why I love carrying it on is a couple of reasons. First, it's got lots of pockets up front. It's really nice when you're going through security. You don't want your wallet, your keys jiggling all around one of those bins. You can just kind of open this up, stick them right in there, and you're good to go. I also like that inside this bag, there are little straps here. It lets me push as much stuff as possible into this carry-on. Nice little spots on the side. Not an endorsement of this particular bag, this brand, but more of this style. The other thing I like to do, because I chose the color black when I travel, if you like colors, get a colorful bag because there's a million black bags, but I don't know how many hot pink ones are out there. I like to stick ID on top, right there. Got my information on it. And then something that kind of makes my bag stick out. I have had an instance on a plane where somebody grabbed a bag that looked exactly like mine, got off the plane, I had a mild freak out. Something like this would go, hey, I don't have a donut on top of my bag, this isn't my bag. So carry on, check bags, this is the go-to. Let's talk about another option, the soft-sided backpack. I love this one, it's carry-on sized. I even keep the tag on it just in case there's ever a question going through of whether or not I can carry this on. Here's the tag that says I could. So we've got same thing, lots of straps, lots of pockets. And what I really like about this style bag is if I'm really trying to overpack, which I try not to, is that when I push this all down, I can strap this together and cinch it as tight as possible to make sure that I'm able to pack as much as I can without having to check a bag. Then we've got the tiny baby backpack version, much like the other one, lots of pockets, lots of straps, lots of compartments. What I really like is for when we're gonna do a lot of day trips, we're gonna walk around maybe Europe or heading to New York City, nice padded shoulder straps. So important to have if you're going to do a lot of walking around town and also important, the hip protection. When you're strapping that on, it lets you have a little bit more protection there on your hips. Another thing I really like about this style bag is pockets in the front, whether you're gonna slide in maybe a, a charger or perhaps a water bottle, it's a nice way to keep that on the go with easy access. Let's talk about this size bag right here. This would be considered the personal item. It's the one you get to carry on free on pretty much every flight. I've had this one for about 20 years and there's a reason why. It's super small, it fits right under the seat or sometimes even sits alongside of me. It's got a couple of pockets. Again, same thing. You wanna stick wallet, keys, passport right in here. It keeps it secure as you're going through security. And then just has a lot of spaces to store stuff for easy access. If I wanna make sure I can grab my headphones out mid-flight or if I wanna grab a snack, I just love having this with me wherever I go on every trip. There's one more kind of bag that I've kind of gotten away from, but I still really like, and that is the soft-sided canvas bag. It is super light, so really helpful if you're gonna go on an airline that will weigh your bag. Oftentimes, if you're going over to Europe or over to Asia, they will weigh your bag, and you wanna have as little weight going towards the actual bag as the stuff that's going inside. The other thing I like is that this bag is really durable. It has been all over the world with me. It's gone to Southeast Asia. It's gone through Europe on, I can't even tell you how many trips, and it's still in one piece. Now, the downside of having that lightweight is that the bag previously had a lot of shoulder padding, had a lot of hip protection. This is just a strap, so not as comfortable, but a really great economical option if you're looking for a good carry-on. For more travel tips and great flight deals, check out cvgairport.com slash jetwithjay.